Up next on Running, the program that showcases athletes in action. They are off in the High Rock Challenge in Staten Island. Two-person teams take on an eclectic variety of obstacles and challenging <laughs> terrain. High Rock is part of the Greenbelt Conservancy and a welcome respite from the busy city. The High Rock Challenge does have a fun and creative element. However, for some, it's really a competition. Uh, we do have a competitive heat in the morning, and we have people repeat every year, and they want to they want to accomplish their PR. We approach it with creativity, with fun, with a sense of humor. It's a really wonderful community event. We design all the challenges and the course with this two-person team in mind, and um, so it gives us a lot of direction, and then it creates a lot of camaraderie with you and your running buddy. A little push here and there can get you over the top. And a High Rock special. Along the way, one team member must paint a picture of something. And not far up the road, a maze that requires a little brain with the brawn. Sometimes you have to balance work and play. Not sure which of those this is. Being a lifetime stat now, the one of the things I've always noticed when I was growing up and running into Greenbelt, I always played here, I used to ride my bikes here and everything. It was always empty. There was never anybody here. So we thought it would be a good idea to bring some people in, introduce them to the trails, and try and get more people out here utilizing this great, fantastic park. 32 miles of pristine single track trail in New York City. And the majority of New Yorkers have no idea that it's here. Oh my God, you gonna let mom do it? Yeah, of course. <laughs> of course. The High Rock Challenge. A little rough and tumble, some sweat and mud, and a welcome finish line for all. <laughs> 